So, how's your stay so far with us, Miss Green? Are you sleeping well? I'm fine. I mean, I had a little trouble sleeping the first two nights, but that medicine you gave me really helped. Okay, that's great. Um, would you say that your symptoms have improved or worsened? Are you still thinking about suicide? I'm fine. I guess. Okay. I wanted to talk to you about something. One of the nurses told me they found your journal in your room. You've been reading my journal? Well, they said you were talking about being anxious in it. Yeah. I guess I feel like I don't belong here. And some of the other patients kind of scare me. Okay. Well, I can assure you there's nothing to be afraid of here. I mean, most of the patients are going through very similar things like you. But if you ever need anything, don't hesitate to talk to a nurse. They'd be happy to help you. Okay. Well, I think that's it for today, Miss Green. Um, make sure you're making an effort to go to the group therapy sessions and let me know if you need anything, okay? Thanks. Okay, so on a scale of one to 10, 10 being the best, one being the worst, how's everyone's mood today? James, let's start with you. Well, I haven't heard any voices since the night before last, so I'd say I'm probably at a five or a six. Okay, that's great. Any improvement is a good improvement. Rowan, how's your mood? Better now. Okay, um, next. Brett, how are you this morning? I could be better. So, you come here often? <laughs> okay, not a funny joke. It's Alora, right? Yeah. I sorry about earlier. Uh, everyone here is crazy, and I saw that you're pretty normal, and I got excited. How do you know I'm not crazy? Well, I haven't seen you talking to the walls, so... Uh, but you're new here, so I guess there's still some time for me to see that. You're pretty quiet, huh? Guess so. Well, you'll talk to me eventually. I'm the only other person here your age, and let's face it, I'm pretty charming. You mean obnoxious? Ouch! She fires back. Look, I'm trying to read here, so could you, I don't know, go away? Hey, uh, you got it, sunshine. Don't miss me too much. Well, this is fun. Why are we here so early? Well, we're alone, aren't we? I just want to spend as much time with you as I can. Well, you're tolerable. <laughs> but I have to know. Why are you here? I know it's none of my business. It's just you seem so normal. And everyone else here is... Well, it's kind of a long story. I got sent to a foster home with my friend Jamie. And the people who were fostering us, they were a couple. And they had a kid. And their kid got really jealous that me and Jamie were getting close to his parents. So their kid murdered Jamie. And his parents blamed it on me. So now I'm here paying for someone else's murder. Someone else's crime. Oh my god. I'm so sorry. But 
why are you still here? It's been so long. Well, I've never left. I don't know what I'd do if I did. You'd make an amazing life for yourself. You are so much better than this place and you never deserve to be here. Thank you. Um, you seem very good today, Miss Green. I've noticed a positive change in your behavior. Yeah, I feel good. I've been good. That's terrific. Well, now that I've seen your overall mental state and you've improved with the medication, I think I'm gonna release you tomorrow. How does that sound? Do you think you're ready to get out into the real world again? Yes. Yes. That's terrific. Well, we're going to release you tomorrow at 8 a.m. Does that sound good to you? <laughs> Sounds great. Well, hello to you, too. You're in a good mood. That's because Dr. Connors just told me I'm going to be discharged tomorrow. What? Yeah, he says he thinks I'm ready to get back out there. Isn't that great? Now we can finally go on a real date. Yeah, that's fucking great, Alora. Get the fuck out of my way! Depression is getting even worse. I need to get out of here so I can end this. You wanted the nurse to see this, didn't you? You're trying to keep me here. Aren't you gonna say anything? I need you, but I can't leave. They're all crazy out there. They don't get us. It's you and me versus them. I love you. 